Oh, I just want to welcome all of you. This is so exciting. Are you Quiero going to darles la bienvenida a todos. For, Estoy muy emocionada. For Eddie and me, and I'm also thankful for Jatana. Para, para Eddie, para mí, para Jatana. And thank you, um, Pastor Mercy. Gracias, Pastora Mercy. And Pastor Alta. And the director of your school, Chrisia Lindsay. And we're so excited that God has added another girl to the Lindsay family. <laughs> okay. You know, Eddie and I graduated from Eddie CFNI yo, graduamos de CFNI a long time ago. Hace mucho tiempo. Eddie in 1975 Eddie and me en 1975. in 1976. Y yo en el 76. And we were married after I graduated. Y nos casamos después que yo me gradué. What you see here today Lo que ustedes ven aquí hoy is like an acorn. Es como una pequeña semilla. That I believe will become a mighty oak one day. Y yo sé que un día va a ser un gran árbol. And this started. Y esto comenzó. In our apartment. En nuestro apartamento. In Maranatha. En Maranatha. On Christ for the Nations campus. En el campus de Christ for the Nations. Is it still called Maranatha? Yes. 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 So that was 1999. Eso fue en 1999 when Eddie was teaching. Cuando Eddie daba clases. <laughs> I wish I could speak Spanish like that. <laughs> My brother does. Mi almost. Habla casi. Almost. Casi. Because he married a lovely lady from Cali, Colombia. Porque se casó con una mujer hermosa yes. de Cali, Colombia. <laughs> And his son married hijo, Didi from El Salvador. Didi del Salvador. And they live in Canada. Y viven en Canada. Now let me see. I told you that I started this in our apartment at Christ for the Nations. At the time, en ese tiempo, we were uh, getting our doctorates from Regent University. Estábamos sacando nuestro doctorado de la Universidad de Regent. I had already written this book ya in, había escrito yo este libro, in the spirit we're equal. En el espíritu somos iguales. It's a spirit-filled perspective. Es una perspectiva llena del Espíritu Santo. I had written parts of the book había escrito parte del libro as research papers during my graduate and undergraduate studies como tareas de mis estudios para graduarme at Oral Roberts University en la Universidad de Oral and Roberts Fuller Theological Seminary y en el seminario Fuller Theological but I completed it pero lo completé when Eddie and I lived Cuando in Founders Court Eddie y yo vivíamos en Founders Court. It took me nine months. Me tomé nueve meses. In 1998. En 1998. To complete this. Completar esto. And God provided miraculously for this to be published. Y Dios proveyó milagrosamente para que se pudiera publicar. Eddie was on faculty at the time. Eddie estaba trabajando como maestro en ese and tiempo. And I gave myself totally to writing and publishing this book. Y yo me dediqué completamente a escribir y publicar el libro. It became the basis for my doctoral dissertation. Fue la base para mi diserción do del doctorado. That answered this question. Que contestó esta pregunta. What should spirit-filled Christians know about biblical womanhood? ¿Qué tienen que saber los cristianos llenos del Espíritu Santo acerca de la mujer en la Biblia? The project part El proyecto of this dissertation de esta dissertación was a study manual, era un estudio manual to go along with this book que fuera junto a este libro. because I wanted those who received it to be able to teach it. Porque yo quería que los que lo recibieran pudieran también enseñarlo. As a part of my project, como parte de mi proyecto, I was required to have a test group 
at Christ for the Nations. Me pidieron que tuviera un grupo de ensayos en Christ for the Nations. And I was given permission to have volunteers among the student body. Y me dieron permiso de tener voluntarios dentro de los estudiantes, del cuerpo de estudiantes. And Eddie and I taught this course. Y Eddie y yo dimos este curso. On one weekend. En un fin de semana. And it transformed every volunteer student in their thinking. Y transformó thinking. el pensamiento de cada estudiante que había sido voluntario. One thing that I've discovered in my many years of education. Una cosa que he descubierto en mis muchos años de estudio in accredited Christian institutions en instituciones cristianas acreditadas was the absence women, women were left out de mujeres Eddie already told you that Eddie ya le dijo eso la mujer estaba fuera del ministerio but in my personal research pero en mis eh, estudios personales I discovered that God had not forgotten his women yo descubrí que Dios no había olvidado a las mujeres we were there and we are here today nosotras estábamos ahí y estamos aquí hoy but God's women had simply been written out pero of las history. mujeres de Dios simplemente habían sido, ex, sido excluidas del ministerio here's what is amazing y esto es lo asombroso In some cases, en algunos casos, what they had done was, was attributed lo que ellas habían hecho se to había men. Sido atribuido a los hombres. The, sad, the saddest thing is this. Lo más es esto. We've lost their role, them as role models. Perdimos el modelo, el rol de modelo de la mujer. We women have not had these role models. Nosotras como mujeres no hemos tenido muchos eh, modelos. So, one important task of this ministry Así que uno de los eh, it, tareas importantes de este ministerio is to write God's women back into history. Es escribir y traer de regreso a estas mujeres a la historia. How important is this? ¿Qué tan importante es esto? In one of Eddie's classes at CFNI, en una de las clases de, eh, de Eddie en CFNI, a new Christian from the, from a communist country. Una cristiana eh, recién nacido en el Señor de Romania. Right. She was in Eddie's class. Ella estaba en la clase de él. And she shared with the class this This experience. Y ella compartió esa experiencia en la clase. She was reading Paul's letters. Ella estaba leyendo las cartas de Pablo. And she could not understand. Y no podía entender. And she asked, y God, preguntó, why do you hate me? Dios, ¿por qué me odias? So then, Entonces, for the sake of the church and for world evangelism, para el beneficio de la iglesia y del evangelismo mundial, it is extremely important, es extremadamente importante, that we get it right about what the Bible teaches about women, que sepamos claramente qué enseña la Biblia acerca de la mujer, and we need the role models in church history, y necesitamos modelos dentro de la iglesia. For three reasons. Para tres razones. To inform us. Para informarnos. To inspire us. Para inspirarnos. And to instruct us. Y para instruirnos. Inform, inspire, and instruct. Informar, inspirar, instruir. And we need the Bible. Y necesitamos la Biblia. With what it really says. Con lo que verdaderamente dice. To show what God wants us men and women to work as a team Para together. Para enseñarnos qué es lo que Dios quiere que trabajemos en equipo, hombre con mujer. We want to see a healthy. Queremos ver. Whole body of Christ. Un cuerpo de Cristo sano, saludable. That, that works in the power of the Holy Spirit. Que trabaja en el poder del Espíritu Santo. To reach your world and our Para world, alcanzar tu where, mundo, nuestro wherever mundo, we are, donde quiera que estemos. and Eddie and I are doing our small part y Eddie y yo estamos haciendo nuestra parte pequeña in God's great big plan en el gran plan de Dios to fulfill the great commission. Para cumplir con la gran comisión. 
That's why we're all here on this earth. Now that has interpretation and I don't have that particular gift, but if you know, I know it has to do with the Great Commission. It has to do with uh, the Great Commission and people sitting here. Tiene que ver con la Gran Comisión y ustedes sentados acá. Come up here, Eddie. Please. And, and you're free if somebody here wants to add to what I'm saying. Si alguien aquí to. quiere agregar algo, tiene la libertad de hacerlo. Yeah, I... Lord, we just, just lift, let's just, let's just pause here and let's just thank him for his presence. Praise you, Lord. Praise you, Father. Praise you, Lord. Glory to your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Praise you, Father. Hallelujah. 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 None of us can do it all. No todos nosotros mm. podemos hacerlo todo. But each of us Pero cada uno can do our small part puede hacer su parte in pequeña. God's big plan. Amen. En el gran plan de Dios. Mm -hmm. Is there anything further about Yeah, God, God is just, I believe there's people here today that you have felt restrained, you have felt held back. But God, God is releasing you. God's Pero removing Dios the, the, the bands. God's removing the things that have held you back and just freeing you up to be all that he wants you to be. Para que sean Hallelujah. Y sean esa que él les llamó a ser. So just be bold sean and do it. Y <laughs> Amen. Glory to God. I would just like to confirm yeah, the ministry that is happening here just now. And, and I really believe that the Lord is saying that today is a day of importance. Historically, it's a day of importance. That he has sent an impartation to go forth today into those whose hearts have been crying out to him, who are prepared, who are ready. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Just do what he says. Don't do, don't do any more, but don't do any less. You matter to him. You matter to your world. Enough preaching. Oh, praise the Lord. I want to share with you Quiero compartirles three more things. Tres cosas más. In 1991, en 1991, Eddie and I were in a small church in New Brunswick, Canada. Eddie y yo estábamos en una iglesia pequeña en Canadá. He was preaching, él estaba predicando, and all of the people on the platform were men. Y todos en la plataforma eran hombres. That's pretty normal, es where normal. it was then. <laughs> But as we praised the Lord, God asked me three questions. Where are my Susannas? And I thought, whoa, that was God. I had been studying God's women in history, so I knew he was talking about Susanna Wesley. Susanna was the mother of someone who is quite famous, John Wesley. Era la mamá de muy famoso, John Wesley. Then he asked me, where are my Susannas? I'm sorry, dijo, where are my Phoebes? ¿Dónde están mis Phoebes? Phoebe, you heard about this morning. De And mañana. where are my Amy's? ¿Y dónde están mis Amy's? Let me just give you one point about each of these. Quiero darles un punto de cada una. First, they overcame tragic personal loss. Primero, ellas sobrepasaron y vencieron una tragedia de pérdida personal. They had much opposition, but they were faithful to God. Tuvieron mucha oposición, pero fueron fieles a Dios. Susanna was alone and had many children to Susana feed estaba sola y tenía muchos niños que while her husband was in prison. Mientras su esposo estaba preso. 
but she was victorious Pero ella fue victoriosa as a mother and as a minister como madre y como ministra in a church world en una, en un mundo de iglesia where women were not allowed to speak or to study donde las mujeres no se les permitía ni hablar ni estudiar Phoebe Palmer Phoebe Palmer although she was her heart was for God a pesar que su corazón era para Dios two of her babies her beloved babies dos de sus bebés amados died tragically in her home trágicamente dentro de su casa she repented of idolizing the babies ella se arrepintió de idolatrar a sus bebés God gave her two more babies Dios le dio dos bebés más and she became the leader y ella se convirtió en la líder of the greatest revival in the 1800s. del avivamiento más grande de los años 1800. Amy Semple McPherson. Amy Semple McPherson. When she was only 19 years old. Cuando apenas tenía 19 años. Could have been destroyed. Pudo haber sido destruida. When her missionary husband died Cuando in China. Cuando su esposo misionero murió en China. She could have been forever bitter. Pudo haber sido amargada para siempre. When she and her newborn baby Cuando ella y su recién nacido returned to America. Regresaron a Estados Unidos. Actually, she was Canadian. Ella I need to canadiense. say that. Ella era canadiense, tengo que decirles eso. Anyway, but you know what happened? Pero ¿sabes qué pasó? She was rejected as a failure. Ella fue rechazada como una perdedora. Because her husband had died. Porque su esposo había muerto. These women. Estas mujeres. Changed their world. Cambiaron sus mundos. And helped us even today. Y nos ayudan hasta el día de hoy. So I wrote a little book one Así Sunday. Así escribí un libro un domingo. And it is out of print. I ya need está, to put it back no tengo más impreso, voy a Now, bringing más. us to the present. Y traen, trayéndonos al, ahora. I want to have a little booklet Quiero tener un pequeño libro of each one de of the women in the Hall of Fame. Aquí en, en el, en el de la fama. So I wrote the first one. You Así see, que it's very primero, small. Es bien pequeño, but it tells the story. Pero dice la historia, it informs us. Nos informa, it inspires us. Nos inspira, men and women. Hombres y mujeres. And then we can, then when God has our minds freed up, y cuando Dios tiene nuestras mentes when libres, we have his word in palabra, our minds and his Holy Spirit nuestro, inspired and flowing through our Santo, hearts, en then it's easy for him to direct our steps. Para que él guíe nuestros pasos. One of our friends, Linda Miller, who is a professor at ORU, Oral Una Roberts University, Linda, que era, es profesora en ORU. Was very inspired by the Fui, life of Lillian Thistlewaite. Por la vida de Lillian Thistlewaite. She has a connection with Christ for the Nations. Ella tiene una conexión con Christ for the Nations. Pauline Parham, who was a teacher there when we were students. Pauline Parham, que era maestra cuando nosotros éramos estudiantes. This was her aunt. Yes. This was her aunt. Fue la tía de ella. And what a powerful little lady who is very quiet, poderosa, callada, very muy quiet. But there is so much to learn Pero about God que de Dios. and about what he wants y each man and each woman to cada do. Hombre, cada mujer. Because she inspired men like ella a John G. Lake, if you Como know John him, si F.F. Bosworth, if you know F. him, F. Bosworth, and many, many others. And then another project y luego otro that we have is the, my story. This es is mi my story. Es mi you have a story. Tú tu Whoever you are, wherever you sea, are, estés, you have a story. Una And so this is not a big biography. No es una gran this is just a little bit of how God inspired me to where we are today. Es apenas un decir de cómo Dios nos inspiró para llegar a donde estamos. And I am so eager to y tell the stories. To, muy emocionada de poder contar las historias. To print the stories de imprimir las historias. Women and de mujeres also of y men de hombres. In the Hall of Fame. En el pasillo de la fama. Okay, Eddie, do you have anything further to say? I just wanted to uh, mention something that I told the 
some came in late. Basically, why I am totally committed, involved in this. Eh, por la razón por la que soy co eh, comprometido completamente en esto. Probably about 10 years ago, Hace diez años, uh, when this vision was in uh, the conception stage, cuando esa visión estaba en etapa de concepción, and I was supportive, y yo estaba apoyando, but I wasn't really committed to it. Pero no estaba comprometido. My attitude was, Mi actitud era, Sue, if you can make it happen, Sue, si tú lo haces funcionar, I'm all for it. Yo te apoyo. But I awakened early one morning. Pero una mañana me desperté. 3 a.m. A las 3 de la mañana. Wide awake, which was unusual. Muy despierto, que es muy inusual. So I went into another room and sat on a couch. Fui a otra habitación, me senté en un sillón. Enjoying the quietness and solitude of the early morning. Disfrutando aquel, aquel silencio de la mañana. And just lifting my heart up to the Lord y and communing with him. Y levantando mi corazón a Dios. And as I was doing this, y hacía eso, my insides became supernaturally quiet and still. Internamente yo estaba en un completo silencio y quietud. And I heard the Holy Spirit say, y escuché que el Espíritu Santo me dijo, as clear as I've ever heard him, tan claro como nunca lo he escuchado. I want you to be more identified with Sue. Quiero que te identifiques más con Sue. And what she is doing. Y lo que ella está haciendo. And then there was a moment of silence. Y luego hubo un silencio. And then I heard these astounding words. Y luego escuché estas palabras. This message este mensaje has the power tiene el poder to begin a mass movement de empezar un movimiento masivo from Islam to Christianity del Islam al cristianismo. beginning with the women. Comenzando con las mujeres. That's so important, I'm going to repeat it. Lo voy a repetir porque es muy importante. I heard the Lord say, Oí a Dios decir, This message has the power este mensaje tiene el poder to begin a mass movement para comenzar un movimiento masivo from Islam to Christianity de Islam al cristianismo, beginning with the women. Comenzando con las mujeres. I knew then Supe entonces, this was not just a woman issue. Que esto no era algo solo de mujeres. This is a church issue. Este es un asunto de iglesia. This is an issue of world evangelism. De evangelismo mundial. This is an issue of completing the Great Commission. De completar la Gran Comisión. Because it's going to take the whole body of Christ. Porque va a involucrar a todo el cuerpo de Cristo. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, Sue, so where do you want to go from here? Okay. If you and Mercy. Yes. And anybody else who wants to share, I'm just working the. Sure. It, it, if anybody has a question. Yes. Now I don't want to put anybody on the spot. Um. And we just met the the new director. No, you're not the new director, are you? How long have you been there? Um. This is my second semester. Oh, your second semester. Hey, well, I'm so glad to meet you, and. Um, yeah, do you have anything you'd like to say? Come on up. Should I speak in English or Spanish? <laughs> your, your, your call. Whatever you want. Okay, and you chose it. Okay. Pues la verdad es que me me conmueve mucho el escuchar todo lo que ellos están haciendo. I'm very moved to hear everything that they're saying. Y ver cómo el Espíritu Santo los está guiando. And see how the Holy Spirit has been guiding them. Que no es solamente cultura general. And it's not only like general culture. O historia. Or history. Sino que Dios está interesado. But God is really interested. En continuar con este movimiento masivo. In continuing with this massive movement. Y me hace pensar. And it makes me think. Que nosotros como jóvenes. That we as young people. Decía Susan. Uh, Susan was saying, Todos tenemos una historia. we all have a, a story. Y es una historia que le estamos escribiendo ahorita. And it's a story that we're writing today. No tenemos que esperar a hacernos más viejos. We don't have to wait to get old. Ya empezamos Amen. a escribir We esta already historia. have started to write that story. Amen. Y Dios nos da la oportunidad and God gives us the opportunity de continuar escribiendo esa historia. To that story. Y creo que no es una casualidad que estamos acá. And it's not just being here for being here. Dios nos permite estar aquí para abrir nuestros ojos. God brought us here to open our eyes. Y ver desde otra perspectiva. And we can see another perspective. The big picture. 
la gran Amen. foto. Hallelujah. Lo que Dios quiere hacer con nuestra What vida. God wants to do with us. Hacia dónde vamos. Where are we going? ¿Qué estamos haciendo? What are we doing? Porque yo lo veo a ustedes y ustedes Because no solo son estudiantes jóvenes. I see you not only as young students. Lo veo como ministros. I see you like ministers. Y como Amen. gente que Dios quiere entrenar. And people that God is training. Y usar. And using como todas estas mujeres like que están aquí. ¿Cuál es la historia que estamos escribiendo ahora? Y yo personalmente me siento retada feel very y desde que entré a este salón I came in this room, he estado pensando I have been thinking, ¿qué estoy haciendo? What am I doing? ¿Qué más voy a hacer? What else am I gonna do? Mm, amen. Y toca mi corazón and it touches my heart. Porque a veces digo, puedo hacer más. Sometimes I say, maybe I can do more. Y quizás nos acomodamos. And many times we get comfortable. Y vemos a estas mujeres, bueno, And tenemos a Mom Lindsay women. aquí. We have Mom Lindsay here in this museum. ¿Verdad? Y ese legado que Dios And that legacy nos está dando. That God has given us. Pertenecemos a un ministerio poderoso. We belong to a powerful ministry. Yes. Amen. 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 Y pues... Así como yo me he sentido retada esta mañana, just like I feel challenged this morning, también quiero retarlos a ustedes. I want to each one of you also. A que continuemos con la visión que Dios ha puesto en el corazón de ellos. Amén. Amén. Y, y que pues hagamos esto poderoso. Amén. Yes. Amén. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> Uh, your words reminded me of something. Sus palabras me recordaron a mí. I love to study history. Me gusta estudiar la historia. I love to teach history. Me gusta enseñar historia. But most of all, Pero sobre todo, I want to make history. Yo quiero hacer historia. Let's make history. Hagamos yeah. historia. Hallelujah. Yes. Alta, can I put you on the spot? <laughs> I'm known to Alta and her husband Jack who's gone on to heaven. Conozco a la pastora Alta y a su esposo. We were all on the faculty together Todos at CFNI. En CFNI. And they were, pa they were at that time, they were the pastors and directors of the uh, pastoral school. Y en ese tiempo ellos eran los directores de la escuela pastoral. And a, a tremendous blessing Una gran all over the world. En todo el mundo. And so, Alta, just whatever's on your heart. Well, you know, uh, Dr. Eddie, when I was listening to Dr. Sue and Eddie, Cuando and Dr. Eddie, Dr. Sue, Dr. Eddie, we have been walking with them for quite a few years, uh, not always at Christ for the Nations together, but we were there, and I remember the times no when por, por, uh, Dr. Sue <laughs> was putting together some of the workbooks and books that she's Ella talking about right now, and I can remember of having times together. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just so excited about this whole thing. <laughs> She's been putting up with me for years too. Hallelujah. But uh, I, I'm just thinking about the many countries that we've had the opportunity uh, as a husband and wife team, like the Hyatts, who have presented to the body of Christ, a husband and wife team who've been gifted with the gifts of God, who truly uh, the Lord has put together a uh, with the mutual support Aquí and honoring of each other. We had a wonderful time with Dr. Vincent Sinan, uh, who was the head of the uh, historical department, I believe, in Regents University, where you were getting one of your doctorates. He's the dean of the, dean. used to be. Yes. And uh, I, I understand he's at Oral Roberts University just now, so it's wonderful. But with uh, Pauline Parham, uh, who was one of my mentors, and I traveled with her to be able to carry on the mantle that God has given to us uh, from Christ for the nations out to the nations. And I thought about the time uh, 
in the last few years when my husband tiempo, and I were invited to go to Romania. Cuando mi esposo y yo fuimos invitados a ir a Romania. The, you were speaking of Romania earlier. Ellos in hablaron the de Romania antes. Uh, but I uh, happened to be one of the first women that they had invited yo, to speak on the church platform. Yo fui una de we las primeras mujeres que fue invitada a predicar en esa plataforma. And I, I didn't realize this until I got over there. And how many of you know sometimes God will put no you in positions ahí, sabes que Dios where you quickly yield to his Holy Spirit, donde tú like just now. Santo, and <laughs> and uh, I had the opportunity to share uh, and preach the word of God as a woman ellos, from the platform mujer, in a church in Romania. Romania. And, the, and there was a great move of God that was beginning to happen across this whole country. So I know that God is starting to truly move with us. And I was thinking, there's many nations that are represented here today, many countries. So if, if you are from someplace besides the United States, would you just stand up for a moment? This is the Spanish program at Christ of the Nations where uh, the director, Crisia Lindsay, and uh, Pastor Mercy, who's over the Spanish YFN. Look at all these different countries here that are here. So I, I'm just going to hold up the microphone and you Voy call out your country where you're from Venezuela Bolivia Bolivia Venezuela Brazil Brazil Mexico 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 Bolivia Bolivia Mexico Mexico Peru Peru, Peru. yes I've been to Peru too Bolivia Mexico praise God Colombia Colombia yes Bolivia. Honduras. Honduras, any other different ones? Ecuador. 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 Look at this group. Look at this Hay group. Atrás. You Chile. don't think Chile. Well, Chile. Well, what an Argentina. historical day Argentina. today. Argentina. March, this is Women's International it is, it is, it is. March 22nd. That's my daughter's, Julie's birthday today. Oye, Happy birthday, Julie. <laughs> yes. Guatemala. Guatemala. And we, we send our greetings to Pastor Reina Salazar and Pastor uh, Antonio Salazar, who have many churches throughout all of these Spanish countries. Uh, we're so grateful uh, for, for the Dr. Hyatt's no, here today. Hyatt, Let's thank the Lord one more time for this vision. hear you say, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Yes, I'm going to Spain, Lord willing, in October, and I can't wait. I just want to share another something that I wrote when we lived uh, escribi, eh, in algo que Founders Court, en Founders Vincent Court. Sinan was mentioned, Vincent, Dr. Vincent Sinan, Dr. Vincent Sinan fue and he asked me to write y me pidió que a chapter, the chapter on spirit-filled women of the 20th century. So you see, many things, good things, Muchas happen on the Christ for the Nations campus. And I am so blessed that God allowed me to be there. Que Dios me estar ahí. I think Jatana would like to share. Jatana is a faithful friend and partner. And then, I just wanted to follow up on something that Eddie said. When I was, I lived in Ireland for several years doing ministry. And in Ireland, they have had equality for women for um, a thousand years. And uh, we had a group from Texas, a church in Texas. And they began teaching complementarian teachings. Ellos empezaron a hablar de enseñanzas complementarias. I saw a friend of mine, she was from Kenya. Y vi una amiga mía de Kenya. 
And she had grown up as a Muslim. Y ella había crecido como musulmán. And I went outside to talk to her. Y salí a hablar con ella. And she was very depressed. Y estaba muy deprimida. She said, I thought we le I left this behind when I left Islam. And I was so glad I was able, I did have Sue's book with me, and I was able to share that with her so that she could understand that that's not what Jesus taught. The other thing I wanted to say is that most of the disciples were teenagers when Jesus called them, and they changed the world. I'm also a history lover, and my husband and I have been watching Hunting Hitler, and I'm amazed at how much Hitler accomplished for evil. <laughs> and each one of you, with God's power, could accomplish the same amount with God's anointing. So, let's, let's go forward with it. We're, we're going to share with you just a, 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 just a little brief video. Uh, th this is a woman whose husband was martyred uh, uh, down in the Amazon, somewhere in South America. You've probably heard of her, uh, Jim Elliott, uh, Elizabeth Elliott. This this is a message that inspired Sue over 40 years ago, almost 50 years ago, inspired her to leave her teaching position, sell her car, leave her teaching position in Canada, and come to Christ for the Nations as a student. And so she wanted to just share this message. It is very, very powerful. Okay, so let's go for it. We will be patient. Okay, uh, and, and we, we, can, we can put that on while we're eating. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you. Uh, you know, my, my heart is blessed this morning. Uh, I know God's presence has been here with us. And uh, I, I, feel, I feel like lifting my heart up into one verse of a, of a worship course. But I, but I don't know what it is. Somebody, somebody break forth in a, a common worship course that everybody knows. Somebody break forth in it. You want to play that? Okay, all right. Do you need to pick? Need a pick? Okay, we're all ready. <laughs> Come in from the mic so she can get you. Yeah, that's good. Let's stand up.
Thanksgiving, and we give you all of the praise, all of the glory, and the honor in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. What, what we're going to do, uh, Jatana back there will help direct you, but uh, but we have trays. We don't have tables to sit at, so there's a tray. You can get a tray and get you a, a sandwich and whatever is out there and just find a seat with a tray. Come back out here, and Sue's going to put this very inspiring message on while we while we eat. So just work your way right back, straight back. Okay, go around, go around and come in at the other side. Hey, God bless you. Good job, good job.